the first half in the 23rd minute, Shep. We go into the locker room. It was all to Tunisia. And then Al Katani in the 57th tying it up. Sammy Al Jaber comes on, gives him the 2 1 lead, and then we saw the dramatic from Jaidi. And here is the World Cup Group H standings. Well, these guys left it all on the field. This was a game both teams knew. There was a possible three points for them, and Tunisia staves off defeat with that stoppage time goal. This group still up in the air. Got to be disappointment for Saudi Arabia with that much time left. There is the final score. Saudi Arabia 2, Tunisia 2. Stand by to find out who the T-Mobile man of the match is. We'll preview Germany and Poland. Reese Davis, Julie Fowdy, Eric Winalda. We go to them in the World Cup Live Studios. Been called worse things, of course, than Reese Davis. Dave Revson here alongside Julie Fowley and Eric Win Winalda, the T Mobile. You man must of call the me match. Ronaldo. I, I did. That would have been that better. That would have been the greatest that compliment been you've ever Well, actually, not right now. He's a little fat. Yeah, and it's, except oh. for after yesterday. He is fat. The F word. All right. Anyway. Uh, what's our reaction to a great match? I mean, as the guy said, incredible finish, Saudi oh Arabia. Oh, my Tunisia. goodness. Well, that, that would have been a huge three points for Saudi Arabia because Ukraine blows out in this first game 4-0. to zero. So if they could have hold, held on and got three points out of that, they're possibly yeah. getting into the second round. Both, both of these teams knew it, too. I think the points were up there for Saudi Arabia. Lemir, you can see the coach from Tunisia was panicking. He's used to this. He was France's coach last time around. At least he got some goals. But this group is, is wide open still, though. I'll tell you what, the Saudis, there's a lot of money probably dancing around yeah. in their head because they're going to 12 million hey, you score a donated goal. to make it no, to but you score round. a goal in a World Cup, they're, they're famous for this. You, you, you get a house, you get a car, you get something if you score for Saudi Arabia. A $12 million pool of money for them. That is their second round incentive. Still obviously have a chance to make it through. T-Mobile Man of the Match coming up momentarily as we roll on on World Cup Live presented by Vonage. Also ahead, the Germans have their captain back. We'll tell you what impact Michael Bollock might have, and we'll tell you why he's the symbol of the new Germany. Also had the latest on the United States. The American players discuss the pointed criticism from Bruce Arena, and what changes will the Americans make against Italy? And we will look back at one of the most impressive opening match performances. Is this finally the year for one of world soccer's great underachievers? ESPN and ABC Sports, official broadcast partner of the 2006 FIFA World Cup and Major League Soccer. The NBA Finals on ABC. Miami stunned Dallas in Game 3 with an incredible comeback. Now the Mavericks look to win one on the road and take a commanding series lead. Game 4, tomorrow, 8.30 Eastern on ABC. What's your financial goal? Secure your future with the AIG companies on your side. Your inner strength, our financial strength. The strength to make life better. Insurance, investments, retirement. AIG, the strength to be there. AIG is lead sponsor of Manchester United. That was an amazing win. How do you feel? I feel great. I feel awful awesome. A lot of people wrote you guys off early this year. Did you have any doubts? No doubts. No doubts. What's it like to be part of sports Ooh. history? I, I have no idea. Can't find the words? No, I'm not on the team. I'm just here for the Bud Light. I, I can get you one. It's a cooler right over here. Are you sure? Woo! Refreshingly smooth Bud Light. Always worth it. The way they work today. It... The FIFA World Cup continues tomorrow. First, Costa Rica meets a surprising Ecuador squad. Next, England battles Trinidad and Tobago. Later, it's a must win for Sweden versus Paraguay. The World Cup continues tomorrow on ESPN2 and ESPN. Would you like to know how much cash you can pull out of your home and refinance your interest only or adjustable mortgage to a low fixed rate? 
Then log on to Ditech.com and use our free online e-appraisal calculator to find out how much your home is really worth. You can also lock in today's low fixed rate with no middleman or broker fees. At Ditech, we guarantee the lowest rate and fee, even if you have a credit problem. Log on to Ditech.com or call 1-800-71-FIXED. When it comes to stupidity, Beavis and Butthead speak volumes. Would you like to see my portfolio? And the next volume is now available on DVD. Beavis and Butthead, the Mike Judge Collection, Volume 2. Yeah. yeah. Call now or order online to receive 40 more of the dumbest cartoons. And if you act now, you'll also receive this limited edition t-shirt featuring one of Mike Judge's earliest sketches of Beavis. Available exclusively through this TV offer. Get this t-shirt and DVD box set for only $34.95. To order, call 800-780-9781 or order online at dvd.mtv.com. Buy it now. World Cup Live presented by Vonage. Time for our T-Mobile Man of the Match. And it's Raddy Jaidi. Unbelievable goal to draw Tunisia level and get them a point in stoppage time, guys. Remarkable. Well, the best part about this game was the fact that the, the, the man of the match changed three times in the last couple <laughs> minutes. Yeah, a wild match. Three goals down the stretch in this one. Two in the closing minutes. One that puts Saudi Arabia ahead. Looked like they had this match won, but Tunisia does get that last-minute goal from Jaidi. And this one ends in a 2-2 draw, and it leaves Group H wide open. Lots more on this match. We'll get you ready as well. For Poland and Germany, that's coming up a special hour-long World Cup Live.